how much how to content is enough? How much how to content is too much? I get asked this question a lot and I just wanted to drop in and say the thing about how to content is it's really useful and it's really vital. But when we give too much how to content, we are actually hurting our audience. And here's why. If you're always providing how to content, the thing is your, your audience is getting this false sense that they can take care of whatever the problem is on their own. Um, like, oh, it's just so easy. She just makes it look so easy. Oh, and here are the four steps and I should be able to do it. And then they start kind of shooting all over themselves, right? The thing about how to content is really great. It's really searchable. It can be very helpful. But if we do it too much, we kind of lull our audiences into thinking they should be able to solve their problem. Here are the easy steps to do it. The problem is what we know as experts is usually our people need their hands held across a bridge while we help them because they're really paying for transformation not information. So I just want you I just want you to think about are you giving all the how to content all the time? Of course it's important. You should sprinkle it in there with your fish food, but it should not be the crux of what you give away because it lulls your people into thinking um and it kind of teases them that they should be able to do it. And then of course if they could do it themselves, they would have done it themselves already. So how much are you giving? Don't give enough away that makes your audience feel like they should be able to do something that they really quite can't do on their own. I hope this is helpful. I would love to know how you feel about how-to content and what you're doing with it currently. Go ahead and drop a note below. Bye.